Well, last week's John Cooper Works hatchback finished in Rebel Green proved very, very popular. The sun is coming out, it's summertime, and it's the time to get yourself a fun, hot hatchback. So this week, I've got another Rebel Green John Cooper Works three-door hatch for you. I'm Harry from Sycamore Peterborough, and today we're going to be taking a look at this lovely approved use mini of the weekend. So without further ado, let's have a look. So here we have it, another lovely three-door John Cooper Works hatchback finished in Rebel Green. This week's model is an LCI 2 model. The LCI 2 is the most recent facelift on the John Cooper Works three-door hatch, featuring a new grille, some new additions in the lighting, a bit more of a revamped interior, and a new back end on the car as well, which I'll cover in today's video. So, as I mentioned, there's been a slight change in the headlights. We've still got that lovely halo ring daytime running light. However, it now has a black centering in there instead of chrome, boosting that sporty look and tying in really, really nicely with that rebel green color and the black headlight surrounding trim. If we move into the front, we can see we've still got the classic bonnet scoop badges and stripes, just like the John Cooper Works iconic design, still that red grill strip, however, a completely redesigned grill, which looks different, yet still very aggressive. Got those huge vents at the bottom there as well. Again, showing that this is a full John Cooper Works model. Moving around the side, we've got completely revamped alloy. So these are the newest version of the 18 inch wheel uh, wrapped there in a run flat tire as well, just to give you that extra coverage and confidence on the road and still housing that huge red John Cooper Works Sport Brake there, giving you plenty of stopping power on what is already a fantastically lightweight vehicle. And we've still got John Cooper Works side scuttles. Again, these have been revamped now with LED lights in. And on this vehicle, unlike last week's, we actually have a black roof and mirrors to fit in nicely with the Rebel Green paint, as opposed to the contrasting red we had last week. Dark and rear privacy glass is also included on this vehicle as well. And moving around to the rear, still we have those lovely Union Jack tail lights with now piano black surrounding as standard. We've got the piano black boot lid and badges, nice and subtle against the Rebel Green considering it's a darker paintwork. Still have that center twin exit chrome exhaust, but with a revamped diffuser which looks even more aggressive now really nice styling on there and of course your iconic john cooper works badge on the back there to show you that this is the full john cooper works model and boot room is no different on the new model it's kept exactly the same as the last one still the same frame shape and size just some little extras so now let's have a look on the inside of what's been changed on there so now moving on inside the John Cooper works with a new steering wheel. This is now a lovely smooth Napa leather steering wheel. And in this case, with this being an eight speed automatic transmission vehicle, we do have paddle shifters on the back of those as well. And as well as that revamped design, we've also got these new gloss black one piece buttons. So these still do multiple functions such as lifting the volume, lowering the volume, changing tracks, etc., and initiating phone calls. But you can see here that they are just one single hard button, a nice clean design there. The seats still following on from the last model. Beautiful Alcantara sporty bucket seats, big side bolsters with a bit of leather on there for contrast. They hold you in the seat really nicely. And that one piece headrest design, keeping it looking sporty. Same on the back of those seats as well. Down the center here, we've got the armrest the gear selector for that eight speed automatic transmission, uh, iDrive controls, and our touchscreen 8.8 .8 inch display, now standard, featuring on this vehicle, Android Auto and Apple CarPlay. We've also got front heat seats as well and all the iconic buttons you'd expect to see down in a mini as usual. Dark and rear privacy glass on here. And this vehicle, it is important to know, is equipped with the premium pack. 
So that rounds off this week's look at our approved used Mini of the weekend, the lovely Rebel Green John Cooper Works Mini three-door hatchback. So if you'd like to come and appreciate just truly how amazing Rebel Green looks when the sun comes out and you'd like to experience the thrill of the John Cooper Works hatchback yourself, give us a call this weekend on 01733 70 70 74 and our friendly sales team will be more than happy to guide you through this vehicle and show you just how many more thrills it can add to those summer Mini adventures. And if you're enjoying this series as always make sure you give this video a thumbs up subscribe to us on our youtube channel if you haven't already i'm harry from sycamore peterborough it's been a pleasure showing you around this vehicle again this week have a fantastic weekend and take care we look forward to welcoming you soon